Hello folks and welcome to another season of Downrange on Precision Hunting TV. This year we got a brand new face, 18 year Army veteran Keith Hall. Keith, good to have you. Yeah, brother. thank you very much for having me on here. Tell us some of your qualifications, dude. Well, I had been selected based on the way I'd been shooting from basic training, you know, on through training into the sniper school. And uh, they had pretty much selected me to be the master gunner for a unit that I was with at that point in time. And they sent me to a unit specific school, which was MLARM, which were, they were standardizing training across the board. Right. So once that training was complete and I got Top Gun there, they ended up sending me to a whole bunch of other schools to include, I worked with Secret Service on some of the stuff of tactics that they utilized. And I went to several other foreign militaries with their sniper school and learned about their tactics, techniques and everything there. So once all that was done, you know, I kind of just taken, once my military service came to, you know, to an end. Due to your injuries. Due to my injuries and everything, I ended up just going ahead and, you know, uh, taking all that I had learned and applying it to what I love to do the most, which is, yeah. is hunting. Honey, I'm right there with you, brother. Well, it's certainly good to have you. Well, I greatly appreciate it. I'm looking forward to having a lot of fun this year. So Keith's on the McWhorter Pro Staff. He's on the Precision Hunting Pro Staff. He's going to help host these downrange segments this year. So that being said, the first thing we want to establish this year is what an ethical shot is. Because on Precision Hunting TV, you will not see us take an unethical, unethical shot. And in a nutshell, I know it's been controversial, but our definition of an ethical shot is a shot taken with 100% expectation of success and a quick, clean kill on a game animal, period. And with that, and that's an excellent definition, and with that definition, you kind of have to look at all the parameters that it that involves, whether it be your equipment, your training, all of those, the environmentals, all of that. You have to take all that into consideration whenever right. you're looking at making an ethical shot. First and foremost, people will always try to, you know, to try to define and have a set range right. that, that, that is an ethical shot. Well, I kind of take and set that range based on the performance of the firearm, the caliber, and the projectile that I chose for that hunt. Right, which we're going to make sure we have that right to begin with. From, we're not going to be hunting going. elk at a thousand yards with something that doesn't have the energy to do that. And the retained velocity. The retained velocity is very, very key because like with a heavier projectile, you're going to have that retained velocity is going to be out there further, lighter projectiles going to be back. Right. But essentially, you just want to stay inside of that to ensure that you're going to pass on a quick ethical kill to that to that game animal. So hunter experience, your equipment, your training, it's all going to, you know, figure in on what your ethical distance all is. And that's not going to be the same for every hunter. And it's not going to be the same for a particular hunter every day. Everything changes and you always have to be cognizant and aware of that and be able to be self-disciplined enough to pull yourself back whenever those things aren't lining up in your face. Absolutely. For example, you know, on a, on a day where I'm sitting there prone and I got a, maybe a two mile an hour constant wind, you know, I got the right weapon for sure. So my ethical range may be 1100 yards because that's a shot that I think I can make 100% of the time. Yep, and then like whenever I have, you know, switching winds, gusting wind, all of that, I'm going to pull way back or I'm going to relocate to where all those conditions are in my favor. That, that afternoon, you know, the wind picks up 6 to 12 and it's swirling, it's not constant, it's just, it's, my ethical range is going to come way in. I mean, that may, that may bring me back to 800. Uh, well, I mean, it's going to bring a lot of people a lot further back. Yeah, that's right. That's so exactly even the most right. experienced hunter and the most experienced long range hunter is going to pull way back on those days. Anyway. Folks, you will not see us take an unethical shot on this show. Just won't do it. That's, no. that's what we're all about. And that's your downrange segment brought to you by McWhorter Custom Rifles.